what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so some news came out yesterday about the upcoming child's play remake we have a new poster as well as a release date the new poster illustrates uh the out the out the outer box of the uh of the good guy packaging that everyone's familiar with that contained chucky in the original film it appears uh the name of the of the uh, good guy doll if it's even going to be called that in this i think the name of the doll in this movie is going to be buddy we still have no word on who is voicing the new chucky doll or in this case buddy i'm assuming that's what the doll's name is going to be buddy our new friends of the end's name is buddy uh the di direct as far as who is directing it because no one no one from the original continuity is involved in this as far as don mancini and, and his whole team is concerned they're going to be continuing their continuity in the form of a tv series uh i think plans i think plans for this remake were always lined up because i just found it very convenient how don mancini wanted to just do a tv series and then now we're finding out that there's going to be a remake. I think there was always something going on involving this remake because everything's been fast tracked. So this has been going on and everything's been going on under 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 everyone's nose. It just wasn't brought to light until recently, a few months ago, as far as what was going on with this remake. Uh, Chucky's been around with audiences since 1988 when the original came out. Everyone knows what goes on in the film. We have Charles Lee Ray played by... Uh, Brad Dorf, he transfers his soul into a doll in a local shop in Chicago after being gunned down by Detective Mike Norris. Uh, the series just progresses and progresses and it follows Charles Lee Ray, nicknamed Chucky, in this good guy doll trying to terrorize and take over the first body to who he reveals his secret to, the fact that he's really alive. Uh, Chucky's been to Chucky's had a bride. He's had a he's had a son slash daughter. He's had a few different things. Chucky's been a staple in the horror genre and until until recently with this announcement. He was the last the last one remaining without a remake. Now I think the only one left is Leprechaun. Leprechaun is the only one that does not have a remake, and I think that's going to change eventually at some point as well. Uh, with, if Leprechaun Returns coming out next month, if that gets a lot of attention, I think we could be seeing some remakes in the future with that series as well. Um, the series, as far as like what's going to happen in this new movie, I I personally think that this is a good thing because Don Mancini, the remake itself, I think this could end up good because Don Mancini is part of the reason why Child's Play started to decline. He's the one behind Seed of Chucky. He's the one that brought it back to some sort of relevance and brought it back to form kind of with curse of chucky and then he started doing his old tricks with cult a bit he did, he brought up some of that seed of chucky elements in the cult cult of chucky and that's really not what we need as far as what chucky is because chucky needs to be i feel like once he took over the series start to start to decline as far as quality goes it's still enjoyable movies don't get me wrong but this is not the way chucky was presented before um mgm is going to be doing this film they did the original uh, the director of this movie is Lars Klevberg. It's going to be written by Tyler Burns Smith. And our cast, as far as who's going to be playing our main main characters, Andy will be played by Gabriel Bateman. Aubrey Plaza plays Andy's mother, Karen. And Brian Tyree Henry is going to be Detective Norris. Um, this remake could either be a hit or miss, of course. That's with any remake. I think this is going to be a hit. That's me personally. I don't think it's going to be anything outlandish. I'm not expecting something. I'm not expecting some complete masterpiece. I'm going to have the same expectations that I have for this Halloween movie. The only difference in this new film, I think, is that Chucky is going to be of a like a robotic form, type of like an AI technology. It's not just going to be a regular puppet from the original classic. I think that this movie could end up being one of the better remakes that have come out in recent memory if they execute it right. Because so far, MGM seems like. The whole mindset behind this is they want to remind Don Mancini of how Chucky is supposed to be done or how a child's play series or a film is supposed to be handled. They want to bring back that mood that's lacking with Don Mancini's films because the original child's play still to this day remains the best one. Uh, the other ones, while they are enjoyable, they just provide way too much exposition as far as like it just becomes too something as simple as child's play like the original and the fact that there's so many sequels for it in fact it's kind of redundant 
it's, it doesn't really make any sense for there to be so many Chucky movies. If I, if you actually sit down and just think about it, there's no real reason for there to be so many Chucky movies at the end of the day. They're all enjoyable and I love all of them, but something so simple like that, it's the same thing with Michael Myers. There's no reason all these sequels should exist because it's going to become repetitive and then it gets to a case where you have to reveal motives and all that. But luckily with Chucky, we already know everything about him in the, in the beginning of the series in the first film. Uh, but that takes away again from the, uh, from the uh, overall like question and the overall enjoyment in a way because you already know everything but that's just the news on the child's play remake the film's going to be released next summer with the toy story 4 film it's going to be competing with that film so that should be a Let me know in the comment section if you haven't already subscribed or turn on post notifications in the description i have links on my social media accounts on my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there to let me know what movies you'd like me to review in the future also keep in mind that i will be back to do my um, halloween resurrection review that will probably be coming up this weekend and i am going to be seeing overlord so if you're going to be if you want to hear an overlord review from me you can be expecting that sometime this weekend or in the early next week with all that in mind guys i will see you for the next video